winds of 195 miles per hour, gusts up to 240. The storm peaked right as it was going ashore in the Philippines. That's the tragedy. Just knowing that lives were going to be lost, infrastructure was going to be destroyed, it's gut-wrenching. And so I told my wife, this is going to be ugly. People are going to die on this one. Finally, at 4.40 a.m. local time, on the morning of November 8th, Typhoon Haiyan hits the east coast of the Philippines and unleashes a nightmare. Most homes and buildings simply cannot withstand such intense 200 mile an hour winds. Roof flying, some things with the flying, unbelievable things like motorbikes flying, even air conditioning units. Our house was already shaking as if the wind is going to uproot the house. Residents take shelter in a local church. I saw the windows already gone and uh, wind coming inside with a mist of water and it's all white. It's all white, circling. Ooh. 